WKU football finished up its seventh day of fall camp on Wednesday, and much of the talk has been about the new-look offense brought on by head coach Tyson Helton and offensive coordinator Brian Ellis. Rightfully so, but the Hilltoppers will also be displaying an experienced and hungry defense under third-year defensive coordinator Clayton White. We are trying to make plays and be the most detailed and disciplined group, but at the same time be unpredictable and aggressive, White said. Guys are competing and guys are learning, they know the system so now they can go out and make plays, have fun and play within themselves, which is what you want for your defense. Junior cornerback Roger Cray gave his thoughts on his and the defense's progression, stating that this season I'm way more comfortable and I can just fly around. He also added that competition has been at a high level because the offense is harder to defend because they are showing us different routes almost every day. Senior defensive lineman Jalen George also shared his experience as a member of the defense so far this fall, you talk about good? I mean we have a good group of guys, and all the young guys are acting like old guys so that makes everyone want to go out there and compete. One player who could be an immediate factor in WKU defense this year is Trey Meadows, a 6'1", 190-pound junior cornerback. Meadows transferred to the Hill from Garden City Community College, and has been on campus since January, but originally went to NC State as a freshman where he first met White. I have known him for years, Meadows said. He is a role model to me and during the recruitment phase he helped me feel comfortable. The respect goes both ways, as White also commented that it has been awesome, he has definitely been a great addition to the secondary. He can do some things that we haven't been able to do in the past. Helton also shared his praises on Meadows, saying that anytime you can get a guy on the outside who has length and is able to get up when they throw the ball down the field helps you out a lot. The Hilltoppers have 22 more days to prepare before their season opener on August 29th versus Central Arkansas. The Thursday night kickoff at Hawkins Smith Stadium will be at 6.30 p.m.